What's up and welcome back in a Spongebob uh, walkthrough. So we're going to uh, continue now. Uh, we're going to Mr. Krupp at the Chum Bucket. I think I can get across here through the air. Just call me a flying fish. Ah. Oh, I missed it. Uh, well, it doesn't matter anyway. If you weren't grilling those patties like an amateur has never cooked before, I wouldn't have to use my chum. Just follow my lead. If I was following your lead, my precious patties would taste like your disgusting chum. Mr. Krabs, what are you doing here? Are you working with Plankton? I had no choice. The poor citizens of Bikini Bottom were starving. I couldn't let him eat the garbage Plankton was serving. I'm right here. So we struck a deal to feed those poor, hungry mouths. So long as they pay, of course. Well, if you don't hurry with those patties, Krabs, nobody will be fed. Then you'll have to say goodbye to your sweet money. SpongeBob, you gotta help us. You're the only one I trust with me secret formula. Could you fix us some more Krabby Patties? I'm on it, Mr. Krabs. Make some Krabby Patties? I'm going to do that. So hungry. Need. Oh, okay. <laughs> and attention. Okay, I'm gonna do this. Wow, oh, guys, okay. let the fully cook. Pretty easy. Thanks, boyo. I know how you like playing dress up, so I've got a little reward for helping out your favorite employer. Okay, back to Cassandra. Wherever she is. I couldn't help but overhear you miss your little pet snail, Walter. Gary. Right, Gary. Well, with this cosmic costume, you should be able to enter the portal he was sucked into. But watch out, honey. That snail of yours is in big, big trouble. A pretty flower costume. We must be going to some gentle land of sunshine and kindness. <laughs> Don't give up, Gare Bear. I'm coming for you. <laughs> Look at these creatures, Patrick. They're Funny? No! Scary! Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was gonna be my second guess. No, oh, this whole place is frightening. It's cold, it's moist, and it smells like the dumpster behind the chum bucket. Well, that sure sounds a lot like this puddle of ooze you're standing in. Ew! It must be the remains of the victims of the monster that came through here. We have to hurry and find Gary! Okay, this is some sort of, uh... Thank you. 
Yeah, we're doing weird world. Bring home Gary. Oh. Let's see where he is then. Yeah, this is a ghost town, sort of. Still in a bush, all right. Or chafing. Remember, SpongeBob, just pretend that scary equals funny and play hide and seek with them. Great idea, and we'll win because they're not even seeking. Candy find a warm and safe place? Too bad I left my candy bar bag in my candy bar bag carrying bag. Candy bar bag I guess I bag. have to put it in my mouth instead. Wait a tide. Something about this ooze seems very familiar. Mm. 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 Calcium with a faint trace of protein and lots of love. That's not ooze, that's slime! Gary slime! That is a lot of slime for such a tiny snail. He must be so scared. We gotta find him! All we have to do is just follow this slime trail through the dark, scary, horrifying city. The creeps. Ooh, I hope they give us creeps. I want mine with powdered sugar. Oh, you're thinking of crepes, Patrick. Crepes? Where? Did I like, come from here? You really are oh, my see. best friend. Yeah, I just made a circle there. Yeah. Ow! No, okay, now... Okay, now I know these things are pretty dangerous. <laughs> Need to uh, get behind them and uh, give them a small scare. Uh oh. It's only moderately horrifying. <laughs> How do we get there?
Can we just not uh, jump from here? No, 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 no. Oh boy. Oh, thank you, Patrick. Thank you. Okay, where did I put me now? I can just make it now. I'm afraid I have not. I'm in the middle of crucial organizing business for the Snail Cup. If you want to enter the race, you need to pay the participation fee of five candy bars. There's only one way to get the amount of candy we need. Take it from babies? No, we go trick-or-treating. Oh, that works too, I guess. So I just need to get lucky with those doors. Have you seen my snail? Tiny, cute, sweet, with very expressive eyelashes. If he's really sweet, then the monster probably took him. He ruined everyone's Halloween by stealing our sweets. The last time it was seen, it crawled down the racing track. I think the track probably leads all the way to its lair. There it feasts on innocent candy and pets. Poor Gary. Patrick, we need to find more candy to get on that racing track. Here, have one of my candy bars for the participation fee. Your awesome costume deserves it. Thanks. We need to find a way into the museum. Only... Okay, let's find the uh, next door. Did you know every word of my school since I was four? Most talented, most coolest kid, because they do. Hey, pretty good dork costume. Very believable. I can't understand your accent. Trick or treat. Oh, why didn't you say so? Here, have a candy bar. A nice costume, by the way. Thank you. All right, <laughs> that's funny how to do a speaking. Get nervous around monsters. Oh my god, there's more of them. <laughs> Sticky sweet. Ooh, look at you! What a nice costume! How can I help you, young fellows? Candy! Candy, 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 candy! Oh, of course, sweetie. Here, have a candy bar. Wow, vintage! Thanks! Yeah, it looked really yummy. I've been trying to find chocolate for three days. There's almost nothing left. Except for, well, I could tell you, but you have to promise to split the spoils. I'm all ears. Well, actually, I'm mostly cellulose, but... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look, a weird and very heavy rock crashed behind my house. Right on my chocolate shed. Maybe you can move it. 
Here, let me open the gate for you. We said a good reason. Okay, there's the house still. Candy, candy, candy! Oh, not there. I don't even get there. That's really hard. Um, okay, from the other side, I guess. first. Ooh, jelly. I defeated the house all the way to the top there. There's no other way. Get there though. I think I can reach this one now. Nope. Okay, we're kind of stuck now. So I have no clue. Give me candy. God, I'm getting there. They okay, must be from that side. Candy, candy, candy! Hello, 
enemy. There is a the pass is next to me, but the way. We made it somehow. Sweet Neptune, are you insane running around like this? Don't you know people have phobias? Sorry, I didn't know my costume was that scary. What are you afraid of? Boxes, man, boxes. You never know what'll be inside or where they'll take you. And then it's too late. And you look just like one. All square-like. Sometimes boxes have good things in them, like Krabby Patties. Oh, yeah. I guess you're right. Here's some candy. Thank you. Balloons? Don't you know people have phobias? That's all the candy we need. Now we can give it all away to Mrs. Puff. What do we do if we have to? No, maybe I should have glided from that uh, coin first. Oh, whatever. Never mind. Just a coin. The Krusty Krab Pizza is a pizza for you and me. You again. Did you bring the participation fee candy? With nuts. Fancy. Now keep still. This is going to hurt. Wait, what? It's a snail race. You have to be a snail and fast. Go! <laughs> Can I need a tutorial for that? Mush, one snail, mush. A little dabble, do ya? Almost there. Um. Okay. Now what? Can I talk with her? Oh, you survived. Now go bother the other kids. Patrick? I thought I was Patrick. No, I'm SpongeBob, you're Patrick. Oh. Maybe we should turn on some lights and make sure. 
A little dabble, do ya? SpongeBob, it's too dark here. Do something. These cables are glowing. Maybe they feel pretty. Yeah, I guess I have to pull all the cables. Now to get to the other ones. I can't tell if my eyes are closed or if it's just dark. Not just dark, Patrick. This is advanced darkness. Almost had me. Okay, one more life, but how do I get the... Uh... What do you get up there? Huh? Okay, there's a hook there. Now what? No! Sandy! I mean... <clears throat> Sandy. The name's Candy, with a C as hard as the toffee and Grandma's candy dish. Thank you for bringing the power back. We're looking for my pet snail, Gary. He got lost, probably kidnapped by a monster. Uh, have you seen him? Haven't seen your pet around, I'm afraid. But that monster? They say its lair is in the museum. It's dangerous, but it might be your best chance of finding your little critter. Sounds reasonable. We should ask this monster if it's seen Gary. Patrick, I don't think monsters can talk. You know what? My little monster theater has been reset. You mind giving me a hand with putting it back in order? If you do, I'll open the way to the museum for you, so you can go look for that monster and your friend. I don't like it, but if there's a chance Gary is with this monster, we have no other choice. Oh, poor Gary. Let's get this theater fixed. Okay, how do we do this? Okay. to be like this thing here. This has to be all the way. Hmm. 
There you go. Thanks, Square Man. Now take your floating buddy out of here before there's an audience arriving. Can't have a scary show with this jolly balloon bobbing about. Look at the show. It's really boring. Oh, look at these gallons of slime, Patrick. Gary must be terrified, poor thing. Maybe it's not all Gary slime. Maybe the monster caught a whole bunch of snails. More sweet babies in danger? Oh, say it isn't so. This slide leads to a whole museum? Gary is so learned. Hey, gliding on my tongue? Well, whatever works, I guess. from that Snails the monster kidnapped. Look, it's Gary. So how do we save Gary without that monster snail seeing us? Gary is the monster snail. Huh? They grow up so fast, don't they? These massive amounts of candy bars must have given him a sugar rush. We can't take him back home like this. We have to cut off his candy supply first. Already on it, buddy! Okay, let's defeat Gary. Oh, oh, what is this? How do we defeat him, though? Up there, I guess. Uh oh. I'm feeling better already. 
Oh, crap. Oh, thank you, Patrick. Thank you. Floor is breaking. Another machine here. <laughs> this shield though, Kerry. It's better to just uh, skip the underwear. That's it. That missed a machine. No clue what happened, but certainly now he is uh, there. He's gonna bring that whole museum down. We have to get him out of here before we're all buried in the rubble. But Gary is still giant. Don't worry, I'm sure he'll go back to normal once we get him home. I sure hope you're right, Patrick. I've never been wrong about anything yet. I think I might have been wrong. I know it's a very challenging situation, but could you stop yammering? I'm trying to concentrate! Uh, that was sheer luck. <clears throat> uh, speaking of which, good news! I found that squiddy neighbor of yours. Just uh, give me more jelly and your new cosmic costume will get you to him. So what are my f first lady stones? What is that? Maybe I'll just <laughs> stay here and nap under my rock. Oh, sorry, Patrick. Balloons and heavy rocks don't go well together. But Fine. Well, Squidward owes me a nap when we find him. Ah, I look like I'm from the Stone Age. <laughs> yeah, yeah, like some idiot who lives under a rock. All right, that was it for this episode. Uh, yeah, finished another level again, and uh, yeah, we'll continue soon again. For now, bye.